This is a big deal. You got a star in the Hollywood Walk of Fame. I did. Can hey. It. No, Look, they no, no. spelled my name right. <laughs> it's like exactly. the craziest thing. I can't get over it. Where it's still is there. It? it is still actually there in front of the Hooters. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, lucky you. I went in and I said, does this mean that I have a better chance for employment if I, you know, <laughs> yeah, if I need helps. it? Because uh, That's a big deal. Yeah, Did everyone come out? And well, then... you know what was cool is my family is not a Hollywood family at all, to say the least. And I called my mom in West Virginia and I, I was just talking about random things and I said oh and then I have the star ceremony and she said what and I said that oh I'm getting this star whatever and she said Jennifer I am coming I am coming to that right Jennifer oh, you are getting a star oh, I, like I never oh. thought I'd have a daughter with a star on the walk of fame oh, come on. <laughs> and so you know once my mom and dad are coming then my sisters came and my nieces and my niece and nephews came and my brothers-in-law came it was oh. really fun is it emotional? It was Damn really, it? I mean, it was so emotional because we've never been together for a career thing. I mean, my career is like a separate thing that I do, but then I'm, when I'm with my family, I'm just with my family. But this was like, we were all together and my kids did were they, there. I was going to say, did really, the kids come out? They did, well, I couldn't exactly say, all your cousins are coming, but you have to stay home. <laughs> so have fun. The family so, reunion. Yeah, was, Get out of here. Yeah, yeah. 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 Don't lick eye contact with grandma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes. So they were all, yeah, they came and it was What'd so much did? more meaningful than I ever really would have thought. bring the kids out to things. It's the first thing I'd ever taken them to. My nine year old daughter actually said to me, Mom, I feel like I've lived on this earth nine and a half years and suddenly today I saw behind a curtain to the other half of your life. She <laughs> said, I just feel like I never really knew. That you had this other life until today. You yeah, were just mom. you just like took pictures with people and were, you know, followed by dodos, but I didn't really <laughs> see it. <laughs> and I was like, <laughs> her mind was kind of blown, you know, you could see, and I thought, wow, that's that's a lot. And I said, Do you like our boring life better or do you kind of wish that you had more of this? And she said, I'll take our boring life, <laughs> but I'm really glad I saw this because now I understand a little bit. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah. A nine, yeah. I have a I have a five year old. I know. Oh, and a, and a three-year-old. I just, she just went to Dude, kindergarten so today. Much. Oh yeah. Did you? <sighs> I didn't cry, but I did kind of. <laughs> I didn't believe you. I didn't no, I didn't know because I, I kind of held it in. Yeah. I didn't want to be the did dad that cries. Did she skip in, or did she? Did you see her trying to be brave? Because that's what I can't handle. No, oh, just even walking to the school oh. made me start getting uh, sad, and I was like, I'm not gonna do it. My wife totally lost it. Of course. She was crying, and she got all the other moms crying. You know, yeah. was crying. Uh, the other dads were cool, so I had to be cool, and I was like, <laughs> See you later. Good job. <laughs> and they're like, Are you okay? I'm like. Everything's fine. <laughs> <laughs> have fun when you have fun in kindergarten. <laughs> I gotta get out of here. You know, it was awful. I couldn't hide it all. Right. Absolutely terrible. I, but I, gosh, I just love the kids. I mean, I want to take them. I, I, I want to take them camping. I want to do. You. I know that you went on a kayak trip. Oh. Man, yeah. Uh, and this is why I probably won't take them on a kayak trip. Oh. Because, well, I mean, well, well, I took my daughter who had every kid in her sixth grade class their culminating project of elementary school was a country report and hers was on Sweden and she got so into it and she loved it so much and she's like mom maybe I'm a socialist <laughs> she's so cute <laughs> so um, she was so into it that I just said you know what I'm gonna take you for like four or five days to Sweden just the two of us so we went we saw people kayaking on outside of Stockholm we went so we start, we do the Big Island record time. I'm, you know, oof. You just, yeah, you're yeah. Like, you're like, <laughs> Molly's in peppermint. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, uh, Molly worked out okay, a little bit for peppermint. So yeah. We did that, no problem. And then they said, this will take you 10 minutes. We did it, except an hour later, we were not back. And not only that, all of a sudden, there were huge bridges going over. They were like, like big boats. <laughs> and it got, it went from very small to quite wide. And then Violet, my daughter, said, Mom, there's a stoplight in the water. <laughs> and there's a stoplight. And through that stoplight, it's a lock to the ocean. <laughs> and so then we start feeling a current pulling us to the ocean. Uh, yes. I was my baby. What and I just was like, la, 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 let's see. Mamma Mia, we're in Sweden. Like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> I turn Let's sing Mamma Mia. <laughs> so I turn around. We're, we're just going as fast as we can. I call the people. 
And I said, I found them. I finally was like, I have a phone with me. I called them and said, um, we're next to this and this. And they said, yeah, no, turn around. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, yeah, no, yeah, no. It's I not said, good. Are you going to come get us? They said, no, no, just. And I said, oh, OK. So we're going. And we were laughing. She was such a sport. We had so much fun. But then suddenly, it was like we saw this blonde human with the sun behind him like a halo. And he was coming to our rescue. And he showed up, and he led us back. And his name was Matt. Oh my goodness. I know. We'll never forget Mateus. I'll never forget Mateus. <laughs> he, saved, he saved your life, isn't he? Saved yeah, us. He, he did. Yeah, yeah, he really did. Yeah. yeah. You didn't really need Mateus, but yeah. that's good. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. uh huh. and on and on. Uh, I said. And it's on and on and on.